What's up everybody, I am back playing even more Pokemon Platinum. It's daytime now. I uh, I did a little bit of stuff off the video, but uh, I evolved Killua. Uh, I didn't realize that he had to have maximum friendship at daytime to evolve, so I put a Soothe Bell on him, did a little bit of grinding, but not too much, um, and now I got myself a nice little Lucario, and I'm ready to kick some ass now, hopefully, in this Ice-type gym. Oh, is it a sliding puzzle? Yes! I freaking love sliding puzzles. Dude, what's going on, man? Hey there, how's it going, champ to be? Do you see the big snowballs placed here and there? You need to slide on the ice with enough momentum to crush them. The gym leader is a user of ice-type Pokemon. Well, obviously. Melt her defenses with scorching hot fire-type moves. It's all about focus with this gym. Bear down and focus. Well, I'm not gonna scorch them. Instead, I'm gonna punch them. How's that sound? This is really cool. I need to figure out where the hell I'm going, though. Could I do like a whoopoo? Oh shit, that is super cool. See, I I, I, uh, I dig this. I dig this very much. Also, before I move forward, I'm thinking I need to do what I said I was gonna do and teach Drain Punch to ya boy. Here we go. This is gonna be like the key to victory here. Yes! Kilo will learn Drain Punch. Become unkillable. The question is, what do I get rid of? I uh, guess reversal? I want to keep Force Palm, but Drain Punch and Force Palm are like the same. But Force Palm has a chance to paralyze. Uh, they're both they're both 6100 though, which is good. And Quick Attack is nice because I like pri uh, priority moves. Ugh, words are hard, man. Words are real friggin' hard. All I know is that now I'm gonna be Drain Punching all these mofos. Also, check this out. When I wanted to max up my friendship, I read online that you can get this Poketch. And, and uh, yeah, I can see uh, I can see my friendship for my boys now. Look, he loves me. Yeah, you gotta get the big hearts. Yeah, look, there's Killua. Oh, he doesn't have the maximum hearts yet. Well, I still have the Soothe Bell on him, so he'll become a better friend in a little bit. In the meantime, I'm gonna kick this guy's ass. We spend all our time battling in the blizzards of Snowpoint City. We'll show you how it's toughened us up. Okay, let's see just how, uh, let's just see how tough you are there, Ace Trainer Anton. Oh, what level are you? 44, holy shit. Well, this will be an uphill battle, or an up-level battle. I only have 5 PP on Drain Punch? What the fuck? I need to PP up that sucker. I didn't realize it was only 5. Ah, that kind of uh, invalidates a lot of my plans. However... It's still a busted ass move, and I'm gonna win this battle because of it. Look at that. Look at all that damage that they did just disappear. <laughs> I like how he's shooting this ice beam out of its forehead, too. I never really, uh. My mental image of Glalie was that it would shoot stuff out of his mouth, but whatever. You know how sprites be. You know how it. You know how it be. You know how it do. Alright, so now even if they crit me, I win. Force Palm. I'm thinking this is going to give like a shit ton of experience too, which I am very down for. Hey, you cut that out right now, mister. Let me put my hand on your face. Take some of that. Yes, that's right. You've just been killed. Killed by kill. That was okay amount of experience. I mean, almost one whole level up. What's with your toughness? It's called Drain Punch, baby. I'm surprised that it only has 5 PP though. That kind of a... Uh... That's a little bit depressing, actually, if I'm being honest. It's a really good move, though, but, uh, dang. Do I have PP ups? Because, uh, right now, this bad news is making my PP down, if you know what I'm talking about. Let's, uh, let's see what other items I got that I could use. Would it be in this pouch? Or would it be in this pouch? There we go. I've got two. Well, having one more drain punch is good. I mean, I'll take it. Whatever. You know, YOLO. Oof. Ow, my face. So it looks like you have to hit them on the down hill if you want to break them. You can't really go up. Oh, yeah, you can't really go up at all. This is a really cool gym. I really freaking like ice puzzles. Yeah. Yeah. See, that's not enough either. This is cool. Okay. Well, I'm thinking Killua is kind of beat up pretty badly right now, so I'll pour some milk on him, and then after that, I'll move on to the next fight. Killua, get some calcium. Yes. Look at you. You're unkillable now. Uh, I guess I'll fight this lady. You want to fight me? I'll drain punch ya. Is the gym's trick floor making you a little hot under the collar? 
If you can't maintain your cool in battle, you'll freeze up. <sighs> Speaking in ice puns, I see. Very nice, Savannah. Very nice. <laughs> I commend you. But now I kill you. Uh, I guess I'll just force palm, honestly. Hey, I'm faster? Wow. They're eight levels higher than me, but Killua is evolved. <gasps> I almost one-shotted that sucker. God dang, that's awesome. Wow. I mean, I guess SnowRun does have pretty low base stats, I imagine. And since I'm evolved, I mean... Ow, jeepers. Actually, no, that's fine. That's fine. I don't care. If anything, it's preferable. Actually, no, it's not preferable. I would always prefer to get the KO, but whatever. It's whatever, you know what I'm saying? I'll just shoot him down and get that goddamn experience. Yes. Killua, you're gonna become unstoppable one day. Very soon, I imagine, actually. If not already. I really like the combo of uh, steel and fighting. It's just a bummer that I'm weak to fighting, despite being fighting, you know? But whatevs, yo. Whatevs. Uh, I'm thinking I could just rock smash here, honestly. That's probably gonna do over half, right? Yeah, oh baby. I could just throw out another one of those and be Gucci. And then uh, on the last one, I'll just drain punch them. Go right back to full. It'll be easy. And if I can get a crit with that drain punch, ooh, ooh, mama. That would be sick. All right, yeah, a little more experience onto your boy. Oh shit, a Glalie. Well, I already defeated that one that was level 44, so. This won't be too hard. Unless they keep spamming protect. See, that's see that that's the bummer with Drain Punch here. They were making the right call giving it limited uh, PP because it's such a busted move. I spam the shit out of Drain Punch in my uh, Pokemon Shield playthrough because it's so good. Look at that. Not even half. Damn. Well, this will still be free. Or freeze. Hopefully I don't get frozen. I haven't been frozen in so long, it's been ages. Yes. I just never want, like, Ice Beam or anything to freeze me. Just please. Ooh, please no freeze. Now quick attack him. Yeah. I'm looking forward to when uh, Killua learns, like, Bullet Punch or something, though. That'll be nice. I would replace Quick Attack for that. Ooh. Oh, yeah. You were surprisingly cool. At least I have my warm boots. Yes. Your boots are quite, quite nice. <laughs> Can I do this to, oh shit, ow, ow. Well, now I just look stupid. I'm trying to figure out the proper path here. Ah, uh, here we go. Aha, uh -huh. that's pretty nice. What I need to do is just shatter all of these freaking snow ass, blocky ass, snowballs ass. All right, this'll be the way to go. I'm gonna go this way and then this way, yes. And then skate right up in this guy's face. It's a good plan, it's a good strategy. It's too, too cold. I can't even feel my tongue. Jeez, that is cold. How are you not, like, freezing to death? You can't even feel your tongue. The snow has infiltrated you too far. We're gonna have to kill him. You hear that, Killua? Alright. Let's see... If I can make it out of this. I hate snow warning. Okay, Drain Punch. I'm absolutely gonna need to visit the Pokemon Center before I can battle the Gym Leader. But we'll see if, how far I can go without doing that. Ooh... That's a lot of damage. Somebody call Phil Swift. That's a lot of damage. Uh-oh. Now this has the potential to be a real pain in my ass. I, um, the attack raising is cool. The confusion, not so cool. However, it's possible that I can make use of it. As long as I don't hit myself. Ow. Only five, actually, that's not too bad. Come on, Killua, you can do it, I believe in you, baby. Fuck. Well, ah, ooh, ow. That's pretty bad. Ah, speaking of pretty bad, it knows wood hammer. <gasps> Ooh, that's not good news at all. Shit. And unfortunately, okay, I'm still gonna go for the big risky move here, though. I'm gonna friggin' YOLO through this. I'm quick attacking again, and if I hit myself again, that's fine. Shit. Damn it. I was really hoping that wouldn't happen. Come on, Killua. See, this is why confusion sucks ass. Ow. Okay, well, at least I've got a backup plan here. Starbright is kind of underleveled now, though. If the gym leader throws out an Obama Snow, or Obama Snow, <laughs> then uh, it's not looking good for your boy. Because, uh, I mean, I can answer with flying type attacks. However, 
I'm very scared of getting hit by Ice Beam. I don't want that. I don't want that one bit. Hey, get that goddamn hail off of me. Come on. <laughs> you cut that out. Okay, what else do you got? A Sneasels. Oh, see, this would be perfect for Lucario. Damn it. All right, well, backup man light coming in. Shit. See, that confusion really did suck. I was going to drain punch this Sneasel, and it would have been great. Although it's also possible that uh, he would be faster. Yeah, see, look, he's faster than light, so he's probably a lot faster than Lucario. I could compare the stats afterwards, though. Thunderfang uh, should do at least half, I'm thinking. Right? Yeah. <gasps> oh, or I could almost one-shot him. What the hell? Why did it do so much damage? Why was that so freaking strong? I'm just going to strengthen. I don't feel like taking any chances now. I'm going to the, go for the gold here. 100 accuracy, boys. Yeah, that's right. God, it's... It's still funny to me how long it takes for strength to actually come out. Like, you curl up into a ball for like three seconds and then you attack. Like, come on. Come on, Sergio. This results. It's cold. Bitter cold. Well, it's also not unexpected. Hmm. I think, uh, since I'm gonna be using Lucario so much, I'm gonna make him the moneymaker. I'm sorry, Schmelly. You've been the moneymaker for so long, but now it's gotta be Killua. And I don't think Killua's friendship matters too much anymore. I mean, I still want to have high friendship with Killua. I mean, of course. I, ca I care about Killua. However, uh, might as well be making mad money. I'm using them in every battle. Might as well get that sick-ass double money, man. Ooh. Ooh, you gotta make that money, though. Alrighty. Heal me up, please. And in the meantime, I'm gonna burp in your face, if that's okay with you. Uh, thank you. Thank you for allowing that. I'm gonna take a sip of my water, actually. Mm -mm. Dang, it is so warm right now. All right. Give me that. Ah, oh, yes. Oh, no, no, no. I'm not trying to talk to you again. No, let me out. Let me out. Oh, there we go. Hey. And now I get to advance. Back into that gym. I'm thinking, uh, even though Lucario's, or Killua, is um, out outmatched level-wise, I'm thinking this is still extremely doable. Also, holy crap, leaving reset all the snowballs. I should have seen that coming. Oh, shoot. I should have seen that coming, too. You're feeling all run down. But a good trainer is one who win who wins no matter the situation. Okay. I'm not feeling too run down, if I'm being honest. Plus, I'm starting to figure out this puzzle as I'm skating around this room. I'm definitely thinking this is, uh... This is near completion. I'm almost there. Also, Drain Punch is going to do quad damage, so whatever Sneasel does, yeah, I'm just going back to full. All right, you're dead. You're dead. Goodbye. Give me the money. Thank you very much. Now give me money. And it's a crit. Oh my god. Could you be more dead, Sneasel? I don't know if you could. It's going to be hard to top that. Hey, there we go. Killua is getting even stronger. Let me see these stat ups. Not bad. Not bad at all. Swords Dance? Holy shit. Uh, Swords Dance could be very busted. But what do I get rid of? I like having priority and quick attack. Force Palm is kind of redundant. I would get rid of Rock Smash. But I can't. I think I get rid of Force Palm right now. Drain Punch is really good. The only problem is there's limited amounts of them, but against the Gym Leader, I could just Swords Dance and then just win. It raises my attack two levels. I mean, come on. I mean, come on. It's busted. Although, maybe I should replace Quick Attack. Uh, I mean, I already made the decision. Here we go. I'm thinking Swords Attack into Destroy Everything is my Gym Leader plan now. Like, as long as Killua survives that first turn, and I guess as long as he doesn't get killed the second turn either. Then boosted up drain punches will carry me to victory. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, give me like sweet ass quad damage. Oh yeah. Hell yeah. That's right, a good trainer will win no matter what situation may be. I don't know if that's true. I mean, you can be a good trainer and still uh, throw in the wrong types. I'm just gonna fight everybody I can, and then I'll solve the puzzle. I've only been involved with Pokemon for a short time. I've managed to get this far, because skilled friends toughen me up. 
Nice. How convenient for you that you have skilled friends. Ace Trainer Brenna. Oh my god, so just more Sneasels. It's gonna be some free wins, baby. Let's see. Like, this is, this is a uh, trial run of my strategy. So what you do is, your swords dance. Oh yeah, here we go. Then my attack sharply rises. And then I go back to full health with every turn. How's that sound? Free win? How's that sound? Pretty good? Pretty good, right? Yeah. Lucario's uh, hand pointer, the little spike there, there, on the hand, um, said there twice, why? I keep on thinking it's my mouse cursor when I look at it, so I'm like trying to move my mouse, like, get off there, what are you doing? But it's not my mouse cursor, it's just a weird Lucario. Anyway, I think since my attack's been increased two levels, I might be able to kill him with just a rock smash. Let's see. Hoots! Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, it was a crit. There we go. At first, I thought that was uh, not a crit. Just, just a raw ass die. 92 attack. Not bad. Not bad at all. Doing pretty well there, Kilua. Ow. Another snow runt. Oh, never mind. This is the first snow runt that this trainer's thrown out. I just, I just blend all these fights together in my my brain. Now kill him. Now you're definitely dead in one hit. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, the the boosted fighting type attacks are really going to carry me here. It's going to be free. I can't believe how tough you are. Hey, I can't believe how much money you gave me. So we're both in shock. Let's see, did I already fight this guy? Nope. My willpower was shaped and tempered by howling blizzards. I'll bring it to bear on you. Okay, dude. Taking yourself real seriously here. Ace Trainer Isaiah. Ooh, Pillow Swine. Ooh, this could be interesting. See, theoretically, he could kill me with a ground type attack. Theoretically. We're gonna see if that is the case, though. I'm faster, so if I don't die here, I go back to full health, right? Oh, there it is, here we go. This is probably gonna kill me, though. It's probably gonna kill me. I'm thinking that the uh, gym leader will probably have a uh, Mama Swine as well. Yep, super effective. Fucking A. Well, there goes that strat. Fortunately, I got Schmelly at least. Let's go, Schmelly. You can do it. I love you, Schmelly. Hey, why is he faster than Schmelly? Hey, cut that out. Stop it. You're being kind of an asshole. Hey, oh, hey, don't you ever do that again. How about instead you just die? How's that sound? Pretty good, right? I hope. Come on, die, baby. Come on, die, baby. Oh, yeah. That's the good stuff. Hmm, and the smelly level. Oh, that was close. You weren't even phased. You spelled phase like phase clan. You weren't even phase clan. Uh, now how do I get the hell out of here? Here's how I get the hell out of here. Oh. Uh, yeah, I'm going about it all wrong, ain't I? I really need to just go heal up one more time, and then I'll solve this gym puzzle. Now let me out of here already, dang it! There we go. I hate having to turn and run away with my tail between my legs. However... Oh, the lighting changed. Daytime is advancing. This is like the first time in a long time that I've recorded actually in the daytime. When I evolved my Lucario, I did it by changing my PC's time today. You know, it's a weekend, I'm chilling out, playing some Platinum, I mean, come on. <laughs> I mean, come on, that's pretty good. Thank you for waiting. We've restored your Pokemon to full health. I hope to see you again. But yeah, notice, uh, or one thing I want to talk about real quick is, uh, this is the weekend right now and I'm playing some Platinum. I think in the future, I don't want to do this anymore. I think if it's the weekend and I have like a long stretch of hours, I would just do one stream instead of record like 10 videos, you know? Moving forward, that's what I'm thinking I'm going to do. And then I'll just upload it in like one big ass, like four hour long chunk. Because sometimes it's painful to, uh, like release content like in 30 minute chunks. For example, when I was playing Temtem, I played that the day it came out, but then there was people who were already le releasing videos the day it came out saying like, hey, here's me battling the first dojo leader. But then like my video of the first dojo leader battle came out like, you know, a week later. And by then everybody had already like seen it and they're like, oh, I already watched this on another channel. And I'm like, ah, oh, dang, am I stupid? I'm not, uh... I'm not releasing stuff in a topical manner. 
I'm slow. I'm slow! Also, let's see. Oh, wait, shit. I want to break all of these dang snowballs now. I need to devise the proper strategy. So far, these are good to knock out for sure. And I definitely want to go this way. You gotta break this one. hi -ya! All right, I'm getting there. What else do I need to break? I need to break these, cent these central ones. If I want to do that, I gotta go over here. I like a so. Yeah! And then I can also break this one real quick. Okay, now if I want to get to that freaking gym leader, I need to shoot through the center. Have I created the path for that yet? Is it just about ready? I think I can access the gym leader now. Yeah, I think I can. Let's see, all you gotta do is do one of these, and do one of these, and then something like like this, and then just hold up. Whee! I made it! That wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad at all. I'm gonna save real quick. And then uh, I'm gonna kick some ass, hopefully. We'll see. If they lead with a pillow swine or whatever, then eh, maybe I need to rethink my strategy. But here we go. Wanna challenge Candace? Sure thing, I was waiting for someone tough. But I should tell you, I'm tough because I know how to focus. Pokemon, fashion, romance, it's all about focus. I'll show you just what I mean. Get ready to lose. All right, it's a battle of focus. Hmm, is she like a schoolgirl? Is that her vibe? Leader Candace. All right, Candace, you wanna fight? Sneasel, perfect. This is the perfect first Pokemon for them to lead with. Honestly, I could Swords Dance twice, potentially. And then they're really fucked. Oh my gosh. Oh, never mind. They know Aerial Ace. Hmm. That could be bad. I'm gonna... I'm gonna be greedy here, though. I'm gonna be super greedy. I'm gonna Swords Dance twice. Just because I'm that greedy. And I know that Aerial Ace is doing a lot of damage, so next turn, I'll pour a Milk onto Killua, and then after that, I'm gonna start Drain Punching everything. The strategy is almost flawless. It... It assumes that they can't one-shot me. And if they throw out like a Pilliswine or a Mamoswine and they Earthquake, and they're faster, then I will get one-shotted. So that kind of fucks up my whole strategy. So hopefully they don't throw out anything like that, but we'll see, this is a nice type gym after all. Anyway, here we go. Operation one-shot is a go. No. Let's see if I can get the first one-shot. Yeah. I mean, there's really no doubt in my mind that this is gonna be a one-shot. It's quad. You know, I probably would have one-shotted them even without the two swords dances, which is a ridiculous amount of attack increase. This is why I need a priority move on Killua. Ooh, good experience. Oh, fucking A. <sighs> Alright, here we go. I've been preparing for this moment. Mentally. I'm pretty sure I'm faster. Drain Punch! Aha! I've sword danced twice! Can you survive? My onslaught? Please die. Oh, yes, there we go. Yes, Operation One-Shot is now looking really freaking good. And I leveled up, so that's pretty good too. And I got three attack off of that one, so ho <laughs> ho. Obama Snow, I'm not afraid of you. I'm not afraid of you. What are you gonna do, mate? Oh no. The hail, what the hail am I gonna do about this? I know, I'll Drain Punch. Let's see, you're probably dead also. I mean, it's it's two Swords Dances, bro. It's it's two Swords Dances. Like, look, it's, it's, just gonna, it's gonna be that easy, you know? It's gonna be that easy. How about you just die? Now, what are they, do you have like a Weevil as your last Pokemon, or is it gonna be a Mammoth Swine? I'm afraid of both. Well, I, no, I'm not afraid of Weevil. I am a little bit afraid of Mammoth Swine, though. Frostlass, actually. Oh, shit. Oh, no. That's very bad news for me. Because fighting can't affect them. Uh, I need to switch. Yeah, this is very bad for me, actually. Um, I think I just throw in light. Killua can't do shit, unfortunately. If I had a Steel-type move on Killua, such as Bullet Punch, then I could have done something. Unfortunately, I'm not at that point yet. I'm gonna break the ice and bring up my last resort Pokemon. Okay, I'll bite you. How about that? Oh no. Come on, baby. Don't kill me, baby. Please. Ooh, that's gonna do a lot, I'm thinking. Okay, bam! 
all, I'm all good. Mm. Oh, that wasn't a whole lot. That wasn't very much damage. <laughs> that was kind of shitty. Okay. Well, they're faster than me. But just in case, I feel like I'm gonna pour some milk. I got. I feel like I gotta pour some milk on it. Just like all my other problems. Pour some milk on it. We'll solve it. We'll feel great. No, I'm just hoping that Blizzard misses. Come on, baby. Don't. Oh shit. Oh man. They're gonna. Blizzard only has 5 PP at least, right? So theoretically, if I wanted to be an asshole, I could just keep on spamming Moo Moo Milks and then win. I've been receiving some comments where people are like, stop using items, and I don't understand that. Like, I'm trying to win here. I mean, is it lame? Is it unexciting? Would they prefer that I lose without using items? Is, is winning using items not cool, but losing without using items cool? I don't know, I wanna win. But at the same time, I mean, I guess I can understand how just, like, turning everything into a, a battle of... Like, look, like, I'll, I'll try to bite. Like, what if I say, yeah, you know what, fuck items, I'm gonna attack. Like, let's see what happens. Oh yeah, they killed me. Duh. <laughs> wow, how unexpected. I don't know, I've just seen a couple of those comments and I'm like, what the fuck? Am I supposed to just go grind in the grass until all my Pokemon are at a higher level? That's boring. Yeah, man, I wish I could use Killua. All right, let's go Schmelly. Unfortunately, Blizzard's gonna hit me like a truck, so I'm just gonna surf and hope I don't get blizzarded. They all hit? Are you kidding me? What is that luck? Or lack thereof on my part? Oh, dang, Schmelly tanky. What the fuck? How do you avoid surf? Are you kidding me? Does hail reduce accuracy? That is some bullshit. That is some big ass bullshit. Ooh, double team. Ooh, great. My favorite. My favorite attack of all. Ah, oh, fucking. What the? What is it? What's going on here? You better cut that shit out right now. Just to prove I'm not going insane. So, let's check that summary. Yeah, let's check them moves. Yeah. Yeah, 100. Um, so I don't know if it's in part of their, uh, oh fuck. I don't know if it's due to their, um, double teams, or if it's due to... Oh, come on! Come on, what is that? What is this terrible luck? That's abysmal. Come on, Schmelly. Oh, fucking A. Schmelly is, like, my main chance to win. Turtu can't get hit by ice moves, and neither can Starbright, and Killua can't attack back. See, this is some turbo bullshit right now, you know? This is some turbo bullshit. I'm sending in Turdu to revive Schmelly. Um, status... Do I have any max revives? I mean, max revives are pretty valuable. Yeah, I've only got one. I've got 30 revives, though. I'm sitting quite pretty. Let's go, Schmelly. Schmelly was taking, like, no damage from them. Yeah, look, he's not gonna use an ice move, actually? I mean, she's not gonna use an ice move, but why? Why not? <laughs> ah, ooh, that's not too much damage. Yeah, and just just for a fighting chance now, pour milk onto Schmelly. Also, yeah, uh, it's very frustrating that hail lowers accuracy without any like clear indicator. Unless it's the double team causing them to evade, but uh, that makes no sense to me. Also, is there only ice move Blizzard? Weird. So they've got Double Team, Psychic, Blizzard, and are they holding out on me with something else? Oh yeah, I could've been biting this whole time. But who knows, maybe that'll miss. Uh, well this is a shit battle, ain't it? This is a mucho shit battle. Oh, and I hit, though. Oh, <laughs> ooh, ooh. See, now that's some damage. Oh, Citrus Berry, that's fine. Actually, that's preferred. Now they're not going to use any healing items because they're pea brain AI. Tell them not to use healing items, unless the fact that they're in yellow will also make her use it. I can sense your will to win, but I promise you, I'm not about to lose. All right, let's see if, how true that is. Okay, Shadow Ball is their last move. It's probably gonna kill. I mean, they got the stab. Oh, it didn't kill, cool. Fucking A, though. There were one, moves with 100 accuracy missing. It's like, that triggers me, man. It's like, I'm so close. Just let me, let me, let me kill this. Let me kill this goddamn Frostlass, come on. Mm. 
Come on. Here we go. Here we go. Big damage. Uh oh. Here we go. Yeah, see, look, she's not doing like nothing. I mean, I did use those revives on Schmelly, so if Turtu falls, which Turtu might, Turtu might die here. But if that does happen, I still got a backup plan. But this is just like a, a frustrating, kind of, kind of lame, like crits again. Like what the fuck? I'm like, I've had terrible luck this fight, right? Like, this is just bad luck. And having the Pokemon battle devolve into luck, it's uh, it's kind of shit. All right, um, Surf, let's hit him with that 100 accuracy move. That's probably gonna miss. Quit raise, quit, quit that. Quit raise, stop that. Oh boy, oh boy. Why is Hale continuing to fall? Was that uh, Frostless's ability? Was it uh, the, s the snow warning or was that from Obama Snow? So I feel like this Hale's been lasting a long ass time. Yay, it's missing again. Yay! If you can't tell, this battle is actually driving me insane. I want to kill this Frostlass now. Just, just fucking... Just... Just... Just hit! There we go! Here we go, baby! Come on, baby! Oh... Yes! Finally! The battle concludes. Yeesh! Yeah. Oh yeah! GG's, Candace. That was an awful battle, and I blame you. I must say, I've warmed up to you. I might even admire you a little. Oh, <laughs> 10k, dang. She, she, she rich. Well, you're great. You've earned my respect. I think your focus and will bowled us over totally. Oh, that's right. I'm supposed to give you this. The, oh, the icicle badge. Thank you very much, Candace. That was an awful battle, Candace. The icicle battle I just gave you. Because you have it, you can use the hidden move Rock Climb anytime, even when you're not in a battle. Oh, and take this too. Ooh, TM72, what's this? Avalanche, ooh. If the user takes damage, the move's power is doubled. Can you imagine what sort of focus you need to pull it off? Avalanche is pretty good. And back I go. Oh wait, shit. Here we go, and back I go now. So, now I can teach Rock Climb. Did I already teach it to Roxo actually? Okay, cool, I did. Oh, let's go, Roxo. Now, I can advance the story. I can go meet up with Dingus and head up to that lake. That would be cool. Anyway, I think that about does it for this episode. Oh, excuse me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna heal. And then uh, after that, I'm gonna save. And then after that, I'm gonna say thank you so much for watching. I do really appreciate you guys hanging out with me playing Platinum. Um, I think that once Platinum and Temtem are done, I'm probably gonna move like only to streaming. I'm gonna give it a try. We'll see how it goes. My number one fear from streaming is just like, I make the move to streaming and then like nobody watches. So I'm like there like sitting alone. Hopefully that doesn't happen, but that is my number one fear. Cause I, I feel like people would stick around for like me making Pokemon stuff. But if I ever tried to play a game, like would they hang out with me or would they not? I don't know. I've had it happen in the past where it's like, I've just streamed to myself for a couple hours and it's depressing and I don't want that to happen. But uh, Thank you guys for hanging out with me on YouTube, at least. I appreciate you watching this video. And until next time, I hope that you all have a good one.